it up, I'm breaking angles like some old tops. My rhyme steady going. Please don't ask me if the flow stop. Deep in the pocket like the roof on a drop top. 101 Dalmatians, the way your boy drop dots. May hold up, I got you diving when I'm juking. The clip so sick, like the smell from when you're pooping. I ain't get nine and click the sub button. And hit the bell, cause I got a lot more of it. Yeah, who's main? Terrence House head, who's main? Fat main, Bruce Wayne. What's good? He was popping YouTube. It's your boy, who's man. You already know what time it is. Getting into another video. But before we get into it, go ahead, hit the subscribe button if you're new. And also hit the bell so you never miss an upload. And yeah, we're about to get into it. So this is going to be more of an update video. Um, didn't do anything over, you know, the weekend really. Um, had the Niners gameplay uploaded that. Um, but other than that, just kind of chilled this weekend. So I'm going to have to get back and uh, record a bunch of stuff. But for right now, I'm just showing you guys, like, I, I don't know if I want to do more uh, Mutt stuff because Mutt is just kind of annoying right now uh, with how, you know, I match up with certain people. But this is all no money spent so far. Uh, Kyle Pitts, Ramchak, uh, all those guys. Got Naheem Hines doing the solos, uh, worked my way up and getting a lot of these guys. Um, Jamar Chase, all that, you see that. Um, defensive wise, got Michael Parsons and Leonard, the, you know, fit in my uh, 4 6. And the only thing that I really changed on the D line was uh, picking up Jeffrey Simmons. So my reasoning behind Simmons was I need speed on this left side and I need more run stopping on the right side. Um, Micah Parsons is kind of a two-way guy where he can play coverage and he can play the run. Uh, Leonard, same way, he's kind of like a middle linebacker. And then you got Zach Cunningham and uh, Simmons, which I'll I flip flop with between these two. Uh, Simmons is going to be more of my nickel and dime backer in the middle, um, whereas uh, Cunningham is going to be more of my uh, you know run heavy guy. Um, I do have Simmons here, and I'm going to try to keep Simmons and Derrick Brown closer to the middle of the field and I'll be blitzing Michael Parsons a lot. Um, honestly, I'll probably be blitzing a lot of these guys a lot, but I don't want it to, you know, be um, too noticeable as who I always blitz, but usually I'm going to try to get Michael Parsons in there. He has the best, uh, you know, block shit and all that stuff. Um, and then that'll leave me to have either Simmons and Darius Leonard back. Um, I would like to change and have a different strong safety, um, preferably one who's better in man coverage, um, maybe a little bigger. I don't know. I'll figure it out. Um, but Simmons right now, a free safety is perfect. He's going to be the center field. He's perfect right now. Um, got to figure out a strong safety and also got to figure out my cornerback situation. Randy Moss is all right. Uh, he's more of a zone guy, but I need, uh, you know, I guess, actually Randy Moss is fine. Um, it's really Kendall Fuller. I'd like to have a tall uh, cornerback uh, in this spot too. And then Caleb Farley in the slot is really nice just because of how fast he is. I'll be sending him in blitzes. So yeah, that's my team really. Uh, I would like to get a better punter seeing as I'll be punting a lot more and then I still have Christian McCaffrey. Um, the one thing that's actually pretty dope though about Naheem Hines, uh, for some reason people think you can't get uh, running back apprentice on any running back right now. Um, you can and you can get him with uh, Naheem Hines. This he has, I have backfield mismatch and then running back apprentice because he's a receiving back. Um, he has some pretty dope attributes too. Uh, 86 speed, 86 uh, acceleration. 
84 catching, and uh, which is really, really good. Um, not the biggest dude, 6'5", 9", 198. Um, not the biggest, but um, I mean, 74 catching traffic is amazing. 87 juke is a great, and uh, 85 spin move is really good as well. Um, he has, where is it? Short route running. Why can I not see short route running? I see mid route running. I don't know if I'm like not reading this correctly, but. Uh, oh, 81 short route running, um, 74 mid and 71 deep. So, I mean, he is absolutely destroying any you know, linebacker coverage, safety coverage too, I feel like, um, especially with that 81 uh, short route running, um, it's going to be really good. And then, um, like I said, with these upgrades I have with the backfield mismatch um, and running back apprentice, uh, this is going to make the scheme that I'm trying to run a lot better because I won't have to use the swing routes. Uh, for you know those flat routes I'm doing and then also uh, I got to the level third was you get CD lamb at 31 CD lamb is perfect for uh, The air raid offense especially this one so uh, He has mid out elite and he's gonna be playing on the outside and the reason why I have mid out is because a lot of the number one receivers on the outside they're gonna be further down the field than the slot guys, your slot guys, um, and a lot of these are going to be further down the field and outside, um, so uh, I, that's the reason I do that, but I, he does have 87 catch and traffic, he has 85 short, 86 mid, and 85 deep, so the fact that he has better mid, you know, is going to prove it there, but he is also very uh, shifty as well. There's 87 juke, 87 spin, um, 87 change of direction. So a lot of the time I'm going to try to get him uh, in the slot as well, move him around. Um, so there's a dope upgrade for that. Um, still running the air raid offense, 4-6 defense. And then as far as um, what I'm going to do, I'm not going to keep up with the whole same lineup thing it's just not going to work with how they do ultimate team so next uh i want to start a franchise but i don't know if i should play or if i should be more of like a coach um the thing with the coaching is i will watch the games and try to like actually set it up to do it like an actual broadcast and i'll just do one a week um that way this lasts quite a bit um or i'll you know try to do it in a way to where it doesn't linger too long but uh we still get through stuff um but yeah so i'll probably just do a steelers um franchise or um let me know in the comments what team you want to see me do i want to do it i'm going to use a team that's not the best i may actually uh use the falcons um, and do the, the like a rebuild kind of thing, uh, and then the storyline is going to be with uh, How Mummy and Mike Leach, and we're going to do the air raid offense and try to change the culture at the Falcons since they do have Desmond Ritter and they have a lot of really dope pieces. It's just they're not the greatest right now, so we'll probably do an Atlanta Falcons uh, rebuild and uh, go from there. Um, and then also, I think that I want to get into uh, face the franchise. I think that'd be fun. Um, I may look into a player that um, I was a huge fan of and then kind of recreate that whole thing. Um, so I have to create an avatar. I haven't even touched any of this yet. So I have to create one a person for this, uh, but I think it'll be pretty cool to go through that. Those two, and then uh, that'll I think that'll make playing this not as uh, annoying for me sometimes because you know playing the same team or you know 
ultimate team gets annoying and then going through all that other stuff gets annoying sometimes so uh, we're going to figure that out. But So we're, we got franchise and face the franchise coming up. And then uh, I'll probably be just doing, uh, you know, online regs more than ultimate team. Uh, and we're going to go from there. So expect more regs, franchise, and face the franchise going forward. Um, and then obviously I'll be doing my, uh, you know, plays and different things like that. I'll be sticking mainly to the air raid offense. Um, so I'll be in the uh, Cardinals playbook and then the spread as well. Uh, because the spread has some stuff that the Cardinals playbook uh, doesn't have. But the Cardinals playbook, you know, it's vice versa. They they both have things that are really nice. Uh, it's just I feel like, I like I'm like i more used to the uh, Cardinals playbook. But there's some really dope stuff in that, that spread playbook. Um, that you can run, especially if you like more of a running style, uh, you know, a lot of motion. Uh, I'd probably use the spread, which maybe I'll practice with the spread and see what I can do with that um, online as well. But other than that, that's about it. Um, yeah, uh, go ahead and hit the subscribe button if you're new, hit the bell, and I'll see y'all in another video. Peace. Thank y'all for coming through to the video. It really means a lot. Go ahead, like I said earlier, if you are new, hit the subscribe button, hit the bell, because we, I mean, we uploading. We, we putting stuff up here every day. And uh, also, hit the like button. Tell me what y'all liked and disliked about the video. What you know, what your boy can improve on. We on Strive. We striving on Strive. We striving to get 400 subscribers this year. Um, and I think we can do it. Uh, also, we part of GITG. Let's give it to God Game Pro. He, he doing it all, so I'm going to just let him do it. You know what I mean? Anyway, thank y'all for coming through, sliding through the video, showing your boy some love. I'll see y'all next time. Peace.